And welcome back everyone, welcome back to Let's Play The Inner World. When last we left off, we finally got this tree fruit. Looks heavy. Throw it on the trap. I don't want to beat him to death. It's hmm. probably forbidden to feed them. Give him Connor back? No, now is no time to fool around. I wonder if we use Connor in the traps. That won't help me with the trap problem. <laughs> Alright, fine. Tree nut. Tree fruit. Darn it, it's slipping out of my fingers. I can't throw it. That's just a random guess, isn't it? I know what to do. That could be fun. Won't help, though. What? Do you need to put it in the swamp? Well, I could, but I won't. You're just an idiot, I guess? That could be fun. <laughs> just give it to him. I don't want... It's probably for... What else can we click on? Let's just... Don't be stupid. He's gonna do it again, isn't he? Darn it, it's slipping. Life is so hard for you. What? Nothing to say. Ah, uh, well. That could be. Let's do the point and click adventure thing you people we always do. No. Just try clicking on everything. You have to use the debris. That won't work. With something. Maybe build a ramp. Well, I thought I was just sliding it down here. Well, I... I can't do that. Nope. That won't... Can we just use this? I can't eat it, but maybe I can throw it. Not very good. I don't think that... I don't think you'll work. <laughs> You're trying that one. I don't. I know. I'm just trying everything. Uh, not there. Not there. Not there. Why should? Fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nothing to say. Try this one well, again. I can't do that. Why should? Actually, I think I tried this too, didn't I? No. All right, fine. Stupid game. I could. That's just a rant. Yes, it is just a random guess because I don't know what to do. Well, we haven't done anything with the swamp yet. Jump Why in. should I do that? Now's not the time for a bath. Oh. So, what are you then? Hello, my little. Can I pet you? Hello, young fella. Jeez. The answer to your first question is, I am a gorf. The answer to your second question is, no, not unless you wish to die a cruel death. Oh, I'm sorry. I had no idea you were able to talk. No problem. Not many know I can. Most of the people who ever got to know me are dead. Actually, all of them are. Um... You should know that 96% of my body consists <laughs> of lethal poisons. Oh my god. Yes. I live safeguarded, but one becomes a bit lonely after a while. What the 4%? Okay. So, um, would you describe yourself as poisonous? Right. Uh, it's the primary self-defense mechanism of my species. Gotcha. So, you can survive in the root forest, even though it's so dangerous? <laughs> to speak the truth here, what makes the root forest so dangerous is the gorfs. But what is so dangerous about you? In principle, you. everything. I secrete a deadly corrosive fluid, my tail is a club of death. Don't even get me started about my claws. <laughs> <laughs> they can sink into anything softer than diamond. 
boy could go on forever. That's weird. Well, let's just keep bothering him. So, you're dangerous. Dangerous is the wrong word. That would imply that you could actually survive my touch. I would describe myself as 100% lethal. Really? Yeah, seriously. High five? <laughs> no, <just kidding. laughs> well, it's actually, I'm kind of curious. I'd kind of like to high five and see. What's so dangerous about your claws? Well, let me put it like this. Actually, I can only move on sturdy rocks. On any other surface, I get stuck because my claws dig in. With time, this stone will also give way. I imagine that must be very exhausting. I would assume. Ah, oh, it's not that bad. It keeps me fit. Interesting. But your claws really are sharp. Just looking so at how them just makes live? my just, eyes tear. You know, I can't yes. go for food. And you're stuck there practical. forever. You can't imagine what happens when I have to scratch myself. Ouch. No, oh, yes, without intending anything of the sort, I cut my own flesh and start bleeding. You don't even want to know the damage my blood can do. Yeah, well, I really don't think I want to know. I was gonna ask, I was hoping blood would show up. Too, With those I'm claws, kinda curious. you can't touch anything. Oh, I can indeed touch things. I simply can't do it without killing them. <laughs> I like this guy. It's not as cool as Denzel, but... What exactly is a secretion? The a god treasure. fluid. Everything oh. that one can secret. For example, my skin and my saliva are extremely corrosive. Which means? That means that when it rains, I don't get wet. Because the water evaporates off of me in about a split second. Useful. I could also spit a hole into this stone pretty easily. <laughs> well. That sounds incredibly impressive. Oh yes it is. I once impressed a girl so much that she actually went out on a date with me. How did it go? Actually, quite well. But when I get nervous, I tend to splutter. Oh, and how did she react? Oh, she completely dissolved. <laughs> get it? Dissolved? No, it's uh, very creepy. Yeah, I guess don't be around when she's got a cold. So, you spit deadly fluids while speaking. Sounds highly impractical. And how? You try meeting ladies as a gorf. Are female gorfs as hazardous as males? Nah, the problem is that they're far more poisonous. If two gorfs fall in love, they really intend to spend the rest of their lives together. How romantic. Yes, well, the rest of their lives isn't particularly long <laughs> anymore. <laughs> Uh, puzzle traps. Can Did you, help you me? set up these traps here? Why would I do that? I'm a legal creature all on my own. But who else could have done it? Bob. No, that was a crazy old man who lives here in the forest. Wink. For a holy man, he exhibits an exceptional creativity when it comes oh. to the killing of intruders. A holy man? Does that mean he's a wind monk? A uh, former wind monk. His fountain dried up. I suspect he still hasn't gotten over it. Ew. Can you help me with traps, though? Why does he set up traps? Does he not want to be found? Oh, who knows what a crazy lost soul wants? A human host. Last time I saw him, he was blabbering about some secret place in the forest that he has to protect. Or an explosion house. That's where we want to go. Right. Super. Now we only have to get past these traps. Well, good luck then. You might as well try to kiss a gorf. <laughs> no, honestly, nobody has ever kissed me before, you know. Huh. Sad life you have. Hmm. The trap system doesn't seem to be very sophisticated. Indeed. But the crazy old man who set them up is an advocate of efficiency. So... They're not clever, but fatal. Ah. So can you help me with this? 
I don't want to beat. Very considerate of you. Okay. Do, do you want this back? Do you still need that? I don't know yet. Then I let it be. We gonna say stuff about everything now? Wow, it's a wonder we survived. Nope. Oops. Maybe if I try throwing it now, he'll help me. Darn it, it's slipping out of my fingers. I well, can't throw it. Don't pick it up! Maybe you put glue in your hand or something. Ah. Thanks, dude. Ha! <laughs> I showed those traps. Is there an explanation? Um, I disarmed the traps. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Poor bird. <gasps> <gasps> Toff mouse, or whatever it's called. It's actually a spider. Who's there? I just wanted... You're a wind monk. You're wearing Wind Guardian's red. Yes. This fabric conceals bloodstains. <laughs> Please, don't kill me. I didn't intend to break your trap. Answer truthfully. Are you a threat to the secrets of the Root Forest? No, I'm not dangerous. I'm the opposite. I'm undanger... Um, Conroy always told me... Conroy? I hate that rotten, devious, treacherous dwarf. If I ever meet that slippery, detestable, naked mole rat again, oh, I'll whoa. kick his wrinkled ass until he can wear himself as a hat. What? No, I, I don't know him. I've never heard of him before. Well, I, I used to be his apprentice a long time ago, but that was probably more than an hour ago. You'll talk sooner or later. Hey, Flute Nose, don't worry. I'll get you down. Hmm? What was that? Alive? Okay, yes, alive. Barely. Oh, I'll play as Laurel. Interesting. What'd she have for stoof? Small box. My chili drops are empty. No more chili drops. Okay, well, let's look at this arrow. The crazy old guy shot an arrow in here. In here? You mean in the forest? It's stuck. That has moss written all over it. Does it? He seems to be hard of hearing. That thing actually belongs to a record player. <laughs> it looks kind of deranged. Unfortunately, it's too far away. I like the Foss Foss. Wind monk. Can we look at him? I hate wind monks. Monks? Wind monks? That idiot. I should leave him hanging up there. Okay, bye. Sounds good enough to me. Yeah, I could just go into the forest. What a strange hat. The guy had an interesting sense of style. Looks Canadian. Hmm. Waka waka. I can't reach it. I can't reach it. Home of the Screamans. Seems to be uninhabited. That's disappointing. I don't want to destroy it. Well, I was actually thinking about you would take it, but... He has a neck pouch. No wonder he's dead. <laughs> I can't reach it. There's a hook. The hook is suspiciously close to the rope. I can't do anything with it. There's a clothesline. Let's see what we can do with it. Okay. You gonna do anything with it? I can't or? reach it. Bye. Alright, so, when we come back, we'll continue playing The Inner World and hopefully save Robert. Um, until then, everyone, see you all then. Bye!